everyone, it is Tuesday and you are watching The Biggest Beauty Project. Um, yes, I'm still in Kentucky, but I'm leaving this afternoon, so this video is going to be unedited, whatever. This week comes, our topic comes from our guest Friday, which you will see on Friday, and she wanted to talk about fat versus health, and she gave us a list of questions, which I will be answering. Are you fat but healthy? When it comes to health, I guess... I'm not as healthy as I'd like to be just because I try to eat better than I should. Um, but at the same time, especially during the summer, like I haven't been working out because I don't have a gym membership. And it's just a lot easier when you're at home to lay around and do nothing. So am I as healthy as I should be? No. But do I think that I'm unhealthy to the point of access? No. Do you feel your weight is affecting your health? Um, to an extent, I'm sure it is. Um, do I have any health issues right now? No. But I guess if I don't become healthier down the road, then yeah, I'm probably going to have health issues. Have you tried a lifestyle change? Um, I don't really know what lifestyle change would be. Have I gone on a diet? Not necessarily a diet, but I've tried eating different foods. Um, right now I'm doing my fitness pal, which seems to be helping a lot. Um, keeps me on track. Um, as far as the next question is, what has worked for you, what hasn't worked for you? My fitness pal really does help me keep track of what I'm eating. The only thing with that is that not every restaurant you go to is going to be on my fitness pal so you have to like guess other restaurants same meal and see how those correlate or if they're equal or it's kind of hard um so my fitness pal works for the most part and um working out what hasn't worked for me is radical diet change i never stick to it and it's just not convenient enough for me and thoughts on gastric bypass. My mom has the uh, band around her stomach, and honestly, I would not recommend it to anyone. She's constantly having issues eating. She she eats too much. She'll throw up. Even though she's had she had her surgery a few years ago, like eating with her is kind of a pain because she can't eat all the things everyone else can. Like, even going to a Chinese restaurant, she had noodles, and she could not eat them because they were getting stuck. And she was, it, it just wasn't happy, and a happy experience. So, I would not recommend gastric bypass to anyone, really, unless that's your last resort, and you're going to stick to the diet as dictated by your doctor. So, that's it for me. Um, I am finishing up my stay at Heather's and then I start class tomorrow. So, getting ready for the routine of school. Um, <laughs> alright, that's it for me. I hope everyone has a great week. I hope everyone had an awesome Labor Day and I will see you later. Bye!